My name is Miss Chrissy, and I'm so excited for you to join us today at Kids Own Online. I love this month. Do you want to know why? Because we're learning just how much Jesus loves us. He really does. He loves us so much. He loves you and you and you. Jesus loves everyone, and he wants us to love others too. Do you know what else I love? Bible verses. We learned a new Bible verse last week. Let's see who remembers. Repeat after me. A friend loves at all times. Proverbs 17, 17. Great, one more time. A friend loves at all times. Proverbs 17, 17. Did you know that Jesus wants to be your best friend forever? Jesus is the best friend we could ever have because he loves us so much. Today, we'll hear a true story about two sisters who were friends with Jesus. I can't wait for you to hear about it. But first, let's stand up and worship God together. God's love don't stop No matter what God's love goes on here and I'm so glad you can join me on this big adventure today. I'm searching all over the sandy desert for buried treasure. Psst. It's just me, Poppy. I'm loving the new sandbox so much that I'm pretending it's a big desert and I'm searching for buried treasure. This is gonna be so much fun. 
Yes, yes, I found just the place. This is where we need to dig for the buried treasure. Poppy, Grandma's here. She really wants to spend some time with you. Hurry home, Poppy. Oh, wow. I completely forgot that Grandma was coming over today. Whenever she visits, she loves for me to play her favorite game with her. Go fish. But I really don't want to stop playing in the new sandbox yet. What should I do? Who? Who? It's Ollie. Hi there, Poppy. Ho, ho. Playing explorer, are you? Hey, Ollie. Yep, I sure am. I'm having so much fun playing in the new sandbox. The problem is my grandma's coming over to visit and I don't want to stop playing in the sandbox yet. Ollie, what should I do? Trying to figure out what to do? I have the perfect story for you. Just listen to this. Just follow me through. Who? Who? Follow me through. Follow me through. Who? I've got a Bible story for me and you. Oh, hey, friends. I'm Justin the Mailman. Look at all of these letters I have today. Friends on a trip. Birthday cards. Oh, and this one is a get well soon card from one sister to another. Oh, that reminds me of today's story. Are you ready for it? Great. I'll just put the story mail in the mailbox and... Okay. So today's true story from the Bible happens at a house like this. Two sisters lived there, Mary and Martha, and they were friends with Jesus. One day, they heard Jesus was coming to visit them at their house. They were so excited, and Martha ran off to get everything ready. Do you like to have friends over at your house? Me too. What do you like to play? Uh, raise your hand if you like to color with your friends. Oh, that's so exciting. Raise your hand if you like to eat snacks with your friends. Mmm, yummy snacks. Raise your hand if you like to play outside with your friends. <laughs> That's so great. It's so good to spend time with friends. As soon as Jesus got to Mary and Martha's house, Mary sat right down at his feet. She wanted to hear everything Jesus had to say. Her friend Jesus was here, and she didn't want to miss anything. But Martha, wait, has anyone seen Martha? There she is. Oh, now she's gone. Martha was very busy. She was here. She was there. She was cooking and cleaning. She was trying to make everything perfect because she loved Jesus so much. And finally, she went to Jesus and said, make my sister help me, I'm doing all the work. But Jesus told Martha that spending time with him is the best thing to do. She didn't need to be worried about the cooking and the cleaning. He just wanted to spend time with her. That's the kind of friend Jesus is. He doesn't need everything to be just right. He loves us no matter what, and he wants to spend time with you, 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 and you. So we should talk to him and dance and sing songs to him and take walks and thank him for all of the things he's made because Jesus loves spending time with us and wants to be our friend forever. Oh, hey there, Ollie. Tell me. Who loves you? Jesus loves me. Yes, it's true. Now let's hear it from you. Tell me, who loves you? Jesus loves me. That's the truth, friends. You better believe it. I'll see you next time. So there's your story. It's all true. Jesus wanted to spend time with Mary and Martha. And he wants to spend time with you, too. Thanks, Sally. Goodbye to you. 
Ho! Ho! Wow, what a great story! Martha was so busy with what she was doing, but Mary stopped to spend time with Jesus. Jesus wanted to spend time with both of them, and he wants to spend time with me and you. I think I got the story. Did you get it? If you did, say, got it. Get it? Got it! Good! I know what I need to do. I should go spend time with my grandma. Hey, I just got a great idea. Maybe I can read her this story from my Bible so I can spend time with her and Jesus too. She'll love that. I'll see you guys next time. Bye! Wow, Martha didn't need to be worried about cooking and cleaning. Jesus just wanted to spend time with her. That's the kind of friend that Jesus is. He doesn't need everything to be just right. He loves us no matter what. And he wants to spend time with you and you and you and you and you and you and you. Who loves you? Jesus! After hearing about Martha and Mary, do you think we should talk to Jesus? Let me see thumbs up. Should we dance and sing songs to him? Should we take walks and thank him for all the things he's made? Absolutely, because Jesus loves spending time with us and wants to be our friend forever. Jesus loves you and wants to spend time with you. Who loves you? Jesus loves you. Jesus loves you. That's right. Let's thank God for sending Jesus. Let's bow our heads and close our eyes so we can focus on thanking God. Jesus, thank you for loving us and wanting to spend time with us. Help us always remember that you love us and want to be our friend forever. Jesus, you're awesome. Amen. Thank you, friends, for joining us today at Kids Zone Online. Next week, we'll hear another amazing Bible story about how much Jesus loves us. I hope you'll join us again. Don't forget to practice your Bible verse this week. And remember, no matter where you go or what you do, who loves you? Jesus loves me. Bye, friends. Bye.